Hey folks, uh, this is uh, the second part of Module 12.1 on circles. Don't forget, all your lessons can be found at MrMathBlog.com. And how do we solve real-world problems that involve circles? Okay, this is an Integrated Math 2 lesson. So, in the last lesson, we learned how to write equations of circles. That's when it was equal to r squared. So, points that are inside a circle satisfy the equation less than your radius squared. That makes sense, doesn't it? I hope. I'll show you pictures of that in just a second. If it's outside the circle, then it would be your circle equation, but greater than r squared. And of course, if it's on the circle, in yesterday's lesson, it was equal to r squared. So these are all the points that are on the circle that are equal to the radius. All right, so here, let's try a couple of applications. Write an inequality representing the given situation, and then draw a circle to solve the problem. Okay, so this table here is showing the locations of homes. A pizza restaurant offers free delivery if it's within a three-mile radius of the restaurant. We'll call it RR for restaurant. Okay, which of the homes would get a free delivery? Okay, so here's um, uh, Al's, Bob's, Carrie's, Dave's, Ed's, and then we got a pizza, and then we got the school here. So um, we're going to use this uh, table for a couple of problems here. So let's plot all these points. So Al is going to be at 3, 2. So over 3, up two is Al's place. Bob is over two, up four. There's Bob right there, okay? And so on. The pizza restaurant is uh, negative one, one. So over one, up one. We'll put RR there. And then all the other points are going to be graphed right there, okay? All right, so um, uh, it says within a three-mile radius of the pizza restaurant. So the pizza restaurant is at negative 1, 1. So here's the restaurant right here. And then we're going to draw a radius, a circle with radius 3. Okay, it says write an inequality that represents this. Okay, so, so there's the equation, the equality, the equation that equals our pizza restaurant. So the radius squared, 3 squared is 9. Okay, so, so it's x minus uh, negative 1 squared becomes x plus 1 squared, and then y minus 1 squared equals the radius squared, which is 3 squared. Okay, so let's go ahead and graph that circle that equals that. Okay, so we're going to go from here, we're going to go up 3, down 3. Remember doing that? And then to the left 3, to the right 3, and then we'll construct our circle right there. Okay. So there's our up three, down three, right three, left three, all that stuff right there. There's our circle. Okay, so uh, to be within the three-mile radius, the inequality that they want us to write is less than nine. Okay, so less than the radius squared. Okay, so all the points that are inside that circle uh, are the ones that are going to get the free delivery. So it looks like uh, uh, Carrie's inside and then and then Dave's inside. So Dave and Carrie are going to get the free delivery right there. Okay, the other ones have to pay for an extra delivery. So Carrie and Dave gets the free delivery. All right, so here's uh, uh, the second problem. Same uh, ordered points, so we don't have to graph them again. It saves me a whole bunch of time. So uh, in order for a student to ride a bus to school, the student must live more than two miles from the school. School. So, whoops, I forgot a period right there. So the school, let me put that period in right there. All right, so the school is right here at 1, negative 2, and the radius is 2. So it's going to be greater than 2 squared, which is 4. Okay, slide that up. So here's the circles equation right there. Okay, so the, the circle, uh, the school has center 1, negative 2. So x minus 1 squared plus uh, y, that should be a plus 2 right there, minus a minus 2 squared, that should be a plus 2, so i get them all changed before I actually teach this class right there. Okay, so that's what's going to be uh, the, the circle equation right there, okay? All right, so uh, let's go ahead and uh, graph that circle right there, okay? So we're going um, uh, we're gonna to go from here, we're going to go um, uh, up 2, because the radius is 2, down 2, to the right 2, to the left 2, and then we'll go ahead and, and graph that circle right there, okay? All right, so let's go ahead and graph it. There's the borders right there, and uh, let's see. So we're going to go ahead and satisfy this inequality. So uh, there should be a plus there, and there should be a plus right here. Let me fix that so I'm all smart when I'm teaching my kiddos. All right, and then... Uh, if you guys haven't, if this is your first time watching, you notice I make mistakes all the time. Okay, so this inequality, so the people who can ride the bus is more than 2, so it's going to be greater than 2 squared, which is 4 right there, okay? So who's farther? Who's outside the circle right there, okay? You ever watch that uh, 
what is that meet the meet the parents or something like that outside the circle of trust anyways so uh carrie's outside she gets a, a school bus ride uh, bob's outside al's outside so those are the ones that are going to get that that free ride uh, to school so they get the, they're eligible for the bus ride right there okay all right you guys i think that's about it yep so if you are in our class that's going to be your assignment right there take care